Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So we have come to the end of this year and let us understand what is that we have learned in 2024 from the experiences of different subscribers who have attended interviews and they have shared the experience. So let us get started without wasting much time. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. So this might be, you know, the last video for this year, but you know, Whatever it has taught us from interview experience perspective, it is very important that we, we learn from it and move forward so that we can successfully, you know, land in the in job that we are aspiring for in 2025. So the first thing is experience thing. Okay. So we understood that first there are limited calls. We know how the market is. And in that limited calls also, we have seen that people with low experience have got less calls. And that is one region where, you know, if I have three years, people started writing, you know, five years and they started attending interviews. That is how they have managed it. Okay. You know, of all that I have heard from our subscribers, that is one thing. Now, second thing is skill set. Now we all learned that you know only Tableau will not be able to help us in landing a job. That is very loud and clear, guys. The sooner you understand this point, the better it will be for you to plan your career. Okay. So we all come with an intention that okay, I will learn Tableau today. I will learn SQL today, and you know, I'll start attending interviews from tomorrow. It is not the case that was happening in 2024. We have seen they needed Tableau, a primary skill. And in this also, they were expecting multiple stacks. So when I say stacks, different tools in Tableau also, like say Tableau desktop is our primary skill, Tableau public they wanted, Tableau, you know, public desktop they wanted, experience, Tableau prep they wanted, so this is only related to Tableau. Now, apart from that, they wanted ETL exposure. Obviously, SQL would be our you know, second addition to Tableau. And then also they wanted uh, you know, Python scripting. So we have seen a tremendous growth in multi skill set. Then only the interviews were getting shortlisted and all okay so focus on acquiring multiple six skill sets if not in 2024 you know try in 2025 to add at least one or two skills to your existing skill set so that you can you know your profile can be shortlisted so this is one big learning from 2024 you know pay attention to this guys you know learning only tableau and only sql will not be able to help maybe you can get a primary role but if at all you want to sustain you need more skills so this is one very very big thing now in this also reporting also they are expecting multiple you know stacks like say they want power bi they want you know click sense but the more you know the better it is like that okay so try to add so if you are someone who is trying to focus more on reporting thing maybe you can add multiple ba tools no if at all you are looking to transition your carrying on you know etl side also then you can add some etl tools like say informatica abinitio and all so if you need any advice on you know what are the skills that i should be looking for in 2025 do write an email i will definitely try to help you out Okay, so this is one thing that we have seen skill gap. So that is where, you know, skill gap also comes. Okay, because what market needed clients or users were not having majority of them, whoever had, you know, uh, they got good calls, they were able to clear and they were able to land a job in 2024. Now, this is about skill set and skill gap. Let us talk about the experiences of interviews. Okay, now gone are those days where only, you know, limited knowledge was enough in Tableau. Now, a lot of SQL exposure is required. They're grilling a lot on SQL skills. 
So first your SQL skill they are testing, then they are testing your Tableau skill. This is also above intermediate level. Beginner will not work. You should be able to write LODs. You should be able to create dashboards. You should be able to work with actions and all. All of this is very important. Okay, so, but to mention one important point, you know, even if they ask all of this, our channel is enough for you to crack a job on Tableau. This I can share hundred percent. Why? Because based on the feedback that I have got from the subscribers who have landed job, I'm not just, you know, giving you a blind statement like that. Okay, so no matter what the scenarios are, how complex it is. So if you just practice, you will be in a very better situation. Okay, so try to complete the scenario list that we have Tableau scenario list and a Tableau interview questions list. If you are very senior, sorry, if you are very senior, uh, sorry, again, sorry, if you are very serious about you know, landing a job in Tableau, then these two playlists should you know give you a lot of information that is needed. Okay, so these are the questions that are currently running and they are the questions, you know, at least 70% of the questions that you need will be covered from this. If the 30% that you are getting, you know, that you will be able to crack by yourself because you have already got the base from this. Okay, so that is why this playlist is very, very, very important. If as someone who is, you know, aspiring, just to start from these two playlists, it should give you a very good heads up, you know, with from any other competitor that is there. Okay, and then you can focus on your SQL knowledge. You know, very, very, very important. Every day you need to learn SQL. Every day you need to write five to six queries. That is when you will become perfect in uh, SQL. Okay, so practice this because this has been one major pain area of a, uh, I mean, uh, SQL, lack of SQL knowledge is one a skill gap that we have in the market right now. Okay, so focus on if you are someone who is aspiring uh, to land a good job in a very good company, like say product based companies or top four MNCs and all, then this is the first thing that you need to focus. Remember this point, very, very important. Okay, no, I you know I'm okay. I can, you know, I can go anywhere and all Then You can focus on this because big companies are always focusing on SQL first. Okay, and then they go with this. But for some, they'll come with the Tableau interview question scenarios and then some SQL. But bottom line is a SQL is very important for you. Okay, so focus on this. So we we spoke about uh, the experience thing. We spoke, uh, we spoke about the skill set that is required. We spoke about the skill gap. Okay, now after this, one major problem that we have seen is the, you know, uh, your experience letters, your documents. So this, I've seen one major pain area for the subscribers who have cleared the interviews and all. So try to, you know, get all your experience documents or experience letters from your previous organizations. It is very, very important. You need last three months of pay slips for sure, for sure your PF statement. Okay, your experience letter from previous ex organizations. So, and you know, form 16 and all, if at all you have that, you can always, you know, keep that handy. Try to upload this to your Google Drive so that whenever they ask, you can just present it. Okay, also have your UAN number handy always and see that all of the previous organizations that you have worked are linked to this UAN number. Multiple UAN numbers some have, maybe you can, you know, showcase that uh, to the HR and all and then, you know, prove that, you know, it is all genuine and all. So this is one problem we have seen. 
okay uh, in 2024 as well so now you know keeping all of this in mind let us you know step forward in 2025 by focusing on one you know acquiring or you know sharpening our existing skills like tableau we will add multi stacks multiple stacks to it like say we want to focus on tableau desktop obviously this is primary then we will focus on tableau prep you know and then we will focus on tableau public and tableau public desktop this is something that you need to start with okay then someone who wants uh, an exposure obviously tableau server this would give you a complete understanding of tableau stacks okay so this is something that you can start with always and then you know increase your sql knowledge you know try focusing learning and acquiring certifications in sql as well try to also acquire a certificate here itself here also maybe you can start with a beginner certification it should help you okay tableau desktop analyst but if you have you know a good experience then you can go for you know tableau analyst this is preferably for senior people but if you are beginner uh, you are uh, looking for you know maybe mid level uh, job then desktop analyst should serve the purpose again focus on sql okay this is something that is very important every day you spend 15 minutes on sql no matter you know you are attending interview you are not attending interview and all because this is like you know your bread and butter in future tableau maybe you know once you finish the playlist you might get it but this is something that needs practice every day in and out okay then try acquiring new skills or add some skills to your profile maybe we can add tableau obviously we can add some bi tools you know if you are focusing on and that you know you want to work in bi only i am a bi guy okay? i want to stay in bi only so i focus more on learning multiple bi tools okay so tableau power bi click sense quick sight you know like that so you can you know learn or add multiple you know skill sets related to that so that you can you know get into an organization if there is tableau opportunity you can work on tableau if there is power bi you can work on power bi click sense you know like that based so you will be like you know uh, one candidate for multiple skill sets so that will give you a uh, very good points compared to others then you can add etl etl is again very important because you know data processing is something that every organization will do okay so they need a guy who can understand the flow of the data okay so focus on that and you know you will land a very very good job okay so etl so you can focus on uh, whatever you want informatica and all okay so that is one thing and uh, so yeah if you add this things you, sh it sh you should be able to get multiple calls attend interviews and all so i'm hoping 2025 would be a positive year for all of you okay we should be able to get more calls than 2024 that is what my expectation is that is what i am praying for so with all with that said you know i wish you a very happy new year okay and i hope you get a uh, the job that you are aspiring for see you in 2025 with the new concepts so i'm trying to bring in uh, power bi in 2025 plus etl and my focus is now on you know sharing the experiences so i'm trying to create a podcast kind of thing okay so that is the trend right now that we are seeing so i want to create videos with the you know subscribers who have attended interviews so that they can share their experiences with our community i want to build our community a stronger community so that we can share the knowledge within ourselves and you know get into uh, a job okay so if you are someone who wants to share your experience you can definitely write 
to me we can connect and we can create this videos with that said looking forward to work with you uh, in 2025 and you know thank you for all the support that you have given me you know uh, with that said you know happy new year once again see you in the next video till then bye bye and have a good day